Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 2 power x plus 4 power x is equal to 8 power x, to find the value of x from this equation. So first, we'll make both of these exponents to have same base of 2, like this. So it will be this, which is 2 power x plus 4 is same as 2 power of 2, then bracket power of x is equal to 8 is 2 power of 3, then bracket power of x. Then in the next step, we make this exponent to have same same exponent of 2 power x. Here 2 power x and here in 2 power x. So to be this 2 power x plus, for this to have 2 power x, we'll take power of x inside, power of 2 outside the bracket. So to be 2 power x bracket power of 2 is equal to, in here we'll take power of x inside, power of 3 outside. So to be 2 power x bracket power of 3. Then in the next step, in here 2 power x is common. So we let u is equal to 2 power x. So it will be u plus u square is equal to u power 3. Then in the next step, we take this u square into the right side and u into the right side. So it will be this, which is u power 3. This when you take to this side to be minus u square and this to be minus u is equal to 0. Then from here u is common. So we'll take u out of bracket. This divided by this is u square. Negative u square divided by u is negative u. Negative u divided by u is negative 1. Bracket is equal to 0. Then from here we have two solutions. Whereas this is the first solution, which is u is equal to 0. And the second solution is this u square minus u minus 1 is equal to 0. Then from here we already get the value of u. To find the value of u from this quadratic equation, we'll use quadratic formula. Whereas from quadratic formula, it is u is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then to find the value of a, b, and c, a is equal to coefficient of u square, it is 1, and b is equal to coefficient of u, it is negative 1, and c is equal to constant, which is negative 1. Then it will be u is equal to negative b is negative 1, plus or minus square root of b square, it will be negative 1 bracket square, then minus 4 times a is 1 times c is negative 1, then over 2 times a is 1. Then it will be u is equal to negative and negative to be positive 1, plus or minus square root of negative 1 square, it is 1, negative 4 times 1 times negative 1, it is positive 4, then over this time this is 2. Then it will be u is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of this plus this is 5 over 2. Now from here I already get the value of u from this quadratic equation. And in, in here well, value of u it is equal to 0. But we recall before we let u is equal to 2 power x, which is this. So from u is equal to 2 power x. Then we compare these two equations. So it will be this, which is 2 power x is equal to 0. But 2 power of any number is greater than 0 or positive value. So it is not equal to 0. Therefore, this sol first solution, it is rejected because it is not possible. And from here, we have two values of u because of plus or minus. Whereas the first value of u is equal to 1 plus 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 and the other value of u is equal to 1 minus square root of 5 over 2. Now from this first value of u it is positive value and this second value of u it is negative value. We know that u is equal to 2 power of x. 2 power of any number it is greater than 0 or positive value. 
and this is negative value so this solution will reject and will continue to compare this 2 power of x is equal to this so it will be 2 power of x is equal to this which is 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then in the next step we apply log in both sides so it will be log of 2 power of x is equal to log of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then this power of x will move to the base so it will be x log of 2 is equal to log of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then in the next step to find the value of x we we'll divide by log of 2 and here divide by log of 2 so this and this will cancel then it will be x is equal to log of this over log of this it will be log of this which is 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then bracket log of, over log of 2 this 2 will be in the base so log of this base of 2 therefore this is the final answer whereas 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 this is golden ratio or we can answer in another way from here 2 power of x is equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 we apply natural log in both sides or ln in both sides so from 2 power of x is equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 we apply ln in both sides so it will be ln of 2 power of x is equal to ln of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then in the next step this power of x will move to the base so it will be x ln of 2 is equal to ln of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then from here we divide by ln of 2 and here divided by ln of 2 so this and this will cancel then it will be x is equal to ln of 1 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 is same as ln of this which is 1 plus square root of 5 then you place bracket then over over 2 is same as minus ln of this 2 then over this ln of 2 then in the next step from here it will be x is equal to ln ln of 2 we divide in this part and in this part so it will be this over this which is ln of 1 plus square root of 5 bracket over ln of 2 then minus ln of 2 divided by ln of 2 is 1 therefore this is the final answer for the value of x in terms of ln or in here it can be x is equal to ln of this over ln of this or oh, this is correct answer in terms of ln or if you use calculator from from this step of x from this step of x is equal to ln of this over ln of 2 ln of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 this is golden ratio so it will be x is equal to log x is equal to log of of this golden ratio golden ratio it is 1 point it, this golden ratio it is 1.618 so it will be log of 1.618 then over this log of 2 so log of 1.618 over log of 2 so over log of 2 then it will be x is equal to log of 1.618 it is 0 
0.98 then over log of 2 it is 0 0.301 then it will be x is equal to this divided by this 0 0.20898 divided by 0 0.301 it is 0 0.694 also this is the final answer for the value of x in this our problem now to check if this value is correct 0 0.68694 from our problem which is, is this 2 power of x plus 4 power of x is equals to 8 so we we'll substitute the value of x is equals to 0 0.694 into these powers so it will be 2 power of 0 0.694 plus 4 power of 0 0.694 is it equal to 8 power of 0 0.694 then from 2 power of 0 0.694 it is 1.61 Seven eight, then plus four power of zero point six nine four. It is two point six one seven one. Then is it equal to eight power of zero point six nine four? It is four point two three three nine. Then the sum of this plus this. Eight plus one is nine. Seven plus four. 7 plus 7 is 14, go with 1. 1 plus 1 is 2 plus 1 is 3. 6 plus 6 is 12, go with 1. 2 plus 1 is 3 plus 1 is 4. Then we compare with this 4.2339. Now we can see this, they are approximately equal. 0 0.2349, 2339. If we round off into two decimal places, it will be 4.23 is equal to, in here we round off into two decimal place, 4.23. Now left side and right side are equal, so it's true for the value of x. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.